Hey everyone, welcome back to Dezola Designed, you guys. How are you doing today? I hope you guys are doing all right. Uh, it is kind of colder over here in the Bay Area, so I am loving, loving, loving this sweater weather. Sweater weather. <laughs> I don't know if you guys have seen that clip. It's really, really funny. Anyway, welcome to Dezola Designs, you guys. Today I have a great um, giveaway. Why do I have so many yarn giveaways? Because I like giving back to my community and I love buying <laughs> yarn <laughs> and using yarn. Um, I was looking at, anyway, scatterbrain here. I have a great yarn giveaway for you. This is the Willow Yarns Rise. This yarn is so gorgeous and super, super spectacular. I love it. I was actually looking at Joanne's website this morning and they have a lot of very, very cool yarns from Big Twist. They have um, an ombre run and then they have a new stripes one. So I think I will be ordering those in the future. I have a ton of yarn for you to pick today, but first I didn't do a Whip Wednesday yesterday. I'm gonna do my Whip Wednesday right now and show you my current Whip um is this fabulousness it's taking a while for me to actually get the pattern down just because i'm frogging a lot um but i think i have it down now and i was on the fence about using mixed yarns but this is my current project if you guys can see if the camera focuses on that this is going to be a blanket and let me put it this way like this can you see that uh it's going to be super spectacular i know it looks like i haven't got a lot done and i really haven't i've just been kind of figuring out the pattern i did get the original pattern it's called the dots and diamonds pattern from one of my books from uh the year 2000 actually but i really really modified the pattern i took out a couple of rows instead of doing front post double um crochet i'm doing like a double triple crochet just because i like the way it looks a lot better and also i'm using the hobie um God, i should have this with me right now it's the hobie wool yarn plus i'm also using the hobie kind feather so this is the wool right here, and this is the kind feather right here. I am I i don't think I've ever made a project before, which is really weird because I've been crocheting 23 years. I don't think I've ever made a project where I've used two different yarns, but this really works. Come on, focus. Um, with this pattern and I think it is super spectacular and I think the blanket is going to look very very awesome I am it is these are the colors of my living room kind of um, but I I am using a bunch of different colors probably like I think eight to ten different colors with the two different yarns so I'm really really excited I have the pattern down now so I just need to sit today I'm just gonna sit and crochet all day which i am very very much looking forward to i'm just gonna go outside and sit down and crochet all day so this obviously is going to take a while this is going to be a throw and um now that i have the pattern down though i will start working on it more and more and then figuring out the um the colors that i want but i really like the colorway so far this is it from behind i think it looks really really pretty and the yarn actually for being wool yarn is really really soft so i'm super excited and that's why i also included the kind feather because i don't know if you guys have used this yarn before this is my first time using this yarn it's kind feather from hobie this yarn is so so incredibly soft it's absolutely ridiculous so just fyi on that i will have the link down below if you guys would like to check it out another thing you guys it is spooky season i know i've been talking about this a lot but if i don't talk about it who else is gonna talk about it <laughs> i am sponsored by hobie so this is why i'm using hobie yarns 
and um, they do send us projects about once a month. They send us campaigns. So this was the um, Helter Skelter campaign, and this is what I made for them. This is a table runner. It's called the Face Lace Table Runner, but I use it as a wrap, and I think it is so gorgeous. I used Hobie Twister yarn for this. The colorway on this is magnificent. Let me wrap this around. It is a, an acrylic and cotton blend, and you can see the colors go from a <laughs> light green all the way to the dark green, and then it goes into the blues and the reds. So it's really, really, really pretty pattern, if I do say so myself. And also, you guys, this is the first pattern that Hobie actually picked up on their website, and they are selling it through Hobie.com. So I'm really, really proud of myself. I also have two more patterns that I will be working on, um, and they also picked those up. So I'm going to have three total, and um, I'll, they'll be selling it through the Hobie website. But if you would like to make this, the pattern is for sale again on Hobie.com and I will have the link. I never know like where it's going to be. I think it's going to be right here. Uh, I'll have the link right up here for you guys. Just thought I'd let you know what's going on with me. Uh, hopefully I'll have more. I'm sure I will have more done so you guys can see more of the pattern by next week. Let me turn the camera around and I will talk about this fabulous Willow Yarns from Hirschner's. Okay, everyone, this is a lot of yarn here. I didn't really realize how much yarn this was. When I buy yarn and when I see yarn at a great price, I buy a lot of it. Uh, just because obviously on this channel, I love giving away yarn just as my thank you to you guys. And just, you know, there's a lot of people that need help right now. So I'm really, really happy to give away yarn. But when I, I buy yarn, I and when it is at a super spectacular price, I know that price isn't going to be there forever. So I do like to buy in bulk. So this is what's happening with me. And if you guys see my videos, I love having the You Pick Yarn giveaway because, I mean, I don't have to, <laughs> I, it's like a no-brainer. I don't have to think about anything. You guys get what you want. And I think that's awesome. Like, wow. So this is the Willow's Yarns Rise. This is from Hirschner's. I Today I was going to make a video on how to find deals, like how I find my deals in yarn. Uh, I thought I could write something down really quick, but it's actually more in depth. So I do have a paper going, my little script going right here. That video will be out next week and I'll show you guys how I find my deals. I kind of don't like, I, I'm kind of hesitant on doing that though because I know a lot of companies watch my videos and they're like, oh, that's how she gets all her cheap. But anyway, that's a whole other video that I'm, I will be working on and how I find my deals. I, I, today, my brain is sidetracked day. Anyway, <laughs> this is going to be your giveaway. It's going to be a two-part giveaway, okay? Meaning you have to answer two questions, and I'll ask the questions at the end, towards the end of the video, okay? So let me talk about this yarn. This is Willow Yarns. Rise, it is from Hirschner's. Hirschner's.com has the best deals. I will say that right now. It has great yarn for incredible prices. Okay, I'm letting you guys know that right now. So the Willow Yarns Rise is 475 yards of beauty. It's 58% cotton, 42% acrylic, and this is a five millimeter hook. This color name is Rouge, and the colors are, um, I don't think Rouge, maybe. Some of the colors have the gradation in them. I think all of them do. You can see in the middle, this one is kind of light. Let me get, oh, I just, I happen to have a flashlight right here. Inside the yarn is lighter. Can you guys see that? You'll see it on the others. 
So it goes from a lighter pink to a dark pink. This color is called Rouge, and I believe I have three of them. Is this one Rouge too? Yes, I have three of the Rouge, okay? So this one is Sea Foam, and this is a gorgeous turquoise, well, it's not really turquoise, teal. Well, it. I mean, it does have like, the turquoise in it, but it does also have greens in it. Can you guys see how gorgeous that is? Look at how pretty that is. Let me hold it closer to the camera. And this is why I got them, because of the color. So this one also inside, let me pull some out. It's green. Do you see that? So it goes from green to a turquoise blue color. Really, really pretty. Again, this one is sea foam, and I have three of those gorgeousness. Then we have meadow, and meadow is the dark green. <laughs> I like this flashlight because you guys can really see the color. It's kind of dark in here. This is a forest green on the outside, and then on the inside, is more of a light green. So this one goes to the light green to kind of the very, very light, light green, like light forest green to the really dark forest green. That is absolutely gorgeous. So this one again is meadow and I have three of those. This would actually be really pretty for a Christmas project, something or other. This one is caramel, and it is a pretty yellow. So this one actually has, do you guys see that sparkle on there? This has a little bit of a sparkle to it, and I just noticed that. Can you guys see that? So caramel on the inside is a little bit darker on the inside. And then it goes to actually light. And this one has a teeniest, tiniest bit of sparkle. It's really, really pretty. This one is caramel and I have one of those. Then we're going to go to this gorgeousness. This is Regal. And it is the purple lavender color. Let's see what color is on the inside. Um, I think this is just the color throughout. So Regal is just a lavender color. You see how pretty that is? And I have three of those. This one is probably my favorite. This is the Coral Reef. It is mixed with oranges and the hot pink kind of red color. And it is, I think this is super, super beautiful. And then on the inside, it does have the lighter orange. So it goes from a lighter orange mixed in with the pink and then mixed in with the orange and the, uh, I would say it's not a true red, it's like a pinky coral color. So this one again is called Coral Reef and I have, two of those did i go through all of these colors yes i did you guys what do you have to do to win this yarn i will let you know in one second first of all i'm going to talk to you guys oh my you know what i will put shine the light on my bracelets here look at how gorgeous that is i don't know why i haven't been doing this before so these are my crystal bracelets, you guys. These are crystal gemstones. This is actually my number one bestseller. That's a galaxy tiger's eye, and you can see why that's my number one bestseller. But I do make these, I hand make them, and I custom make them to fit your wrists. These are all real gemstones. We have the blue tiger's eye right here, kiwi jasper galaxy tiger's eye. That's actually dyed. We have the green aventurine and then the silver sheen obsidian 
on this. Ooh, la la, look at how pretty that is. You can really see the Super 7 right there. This is Super 7, this is AB Quartz Crystal. This is the Cracked Crystal with Silver Sheen Obsidian. And then this one is the Golden Obsidian. You guys can really see that. They make great gifts. Christmas is coming up around the corner, you guys. If you would like to check out my current inventory, I'll have the link right up here. I'll also have all of my links down below in the comment section. For all of my bracelet gals, I know I, I haven't been making a lot of contact with that, you guys. I will start again. I just put in a brand new order for a ton of new gorgeous beads. They're all so beautiful. So I'll be making that content. Anyway, check it out. So what do you have to do to win this yard? All you have to do is, again, it's a two-part question. Pick four of your favorites. <coughs> Excuse me. You can mix and match the colors. You can um, pick like three of the purples, but you guys have to tell me the name of the colors that you want. And it's spooky season. All of my questions are spooky themed related. Let me know what is your favorite Halloween costume ever. I always go as a witch of some kind. It's my go-to. I love it. Or a ghoul, like, or, or a witchy ghoul. So again, in the comments, please pick four of your favorites. You have to tell me the name. Plus, let me know what your favorite costume is, you guys. Halloween costume, down below in the comments. Thank you so, so much for watching. I can't thank you guys enough. Thank you so, so much for watching my channel. I hope everyone is doing well, and we will talk to each other in the next video. You guys, good luck. And we'll talk to you soon. Bye.